This is the Mondo Coaches Interview. I'm Dean Link, along with the head coach of the University of Louisville. We're talking about Ken Lola. Ken, first off, talk about uh, the excitement on being, on being on Fox Soccer Channel on behalf of the NSCAA. Well, it's a great opportunity for our kids. Uh, one, uh, to play college soccer and play on national TV, especially Fox Soccer, is a wonderful opportunity. It gives them an opportunity to showcase their talents, and uh, we, we feel very blessed to be a part of it. Now, talk about your coaching style, particularly the style of play people see from your teams, first at Akron and now at Louisville. Well, we do two things. One, on the defensive side of it, we try to create pressure, and, and our pressure many times creates the attack. We like it to be free-flowing. Um, but with, with the attack as well is make it penetrating, put teams under pressure by what we do by going forward. A lot of coaches decide to be a coach based on their experiences. You played under John Rennie, the fine head coach at Duke. What did he teach you about coaching? I, w I would say just a professional attitude he took to everything. He was very detailed, very organized, uh, and, and a very good tactician of the game as well. He was very smart about how he coached and what he did, and uh, that left an impression on me for sure. Now, your dad was a dentist, your sister was a dentist, a lot of people in your family in the medical profession. What made you be drawn to coaching? It, it, was, the, it was the ability to have an impact on kids' lives. That was it. Uh, once I started getting into coaching, I understood through uh, the vehicle of soccer uh, that we had the ability to, to change kids' lives and teach them principles, both from a soccer standpoint, but more importantly, from a, a personal standpoint, life skills. Uh, soccer ends up being a, a wonderful microcosm of life and using that we can teach them so many things. Uh, certainly uh, the passion we have for the game but more importantly life skills. 13 great years at Akron. Talk about how you built that program during those 13 years. Well it was it was one step at a time. It took, uh, it took all 13 years to get to where we were and uh, a lot of that had to do with my growth as a coach first that allowed me to have a bigger impact on the kids. And, uh, you know, we, we, we saw the program grow in, in steps that we got to, to be one of the best teams in the country. And uh, we're very excited to, uh, to, to get it to that point. You make that great run, then you get the call from Louisville. Talk about your decision to come to Louisville and coach the Cardinals men's soccer team. Well, it was, it was difficult because of our experience at Akron. We had so many good relationships, uh, very, very fine people associated with the school as well as the, the athletic department, and the many kids that we developed relationships with there, not to mention that my wife, her family was from that area. Uh, so to leave, it, it, it took a lot of courage to do it. Uh, we contemplated it, but knew that Louisville was the right place. Uh, what Tom George is doing here and continues to do here is extremely impressive. He, he, uh, he has put together a, a tremendous staff in the athletic department. He has an impact within the university, and we're so fortunate to be a part of that. And um, you know, Tom's vision uh, was what, what brought me here, and his continued drive is what makes uh, U of L what it is athletically. And it didn't take you long to achieve success. Back-to-back -back NCAA trips. You start the season 3-0, and outscored your three opponents 7-0. to What are your expectations this season? Well, we have high expectations, but uh, what determines whether we'll realize it is our growth and, and how much we grow from the beginning of the season to the end. And, and that will be determined on how focused we are every single day. You know, the, the days like this, it's a great day to... Uh, showcase what we've done, but it, it's the days in between when we play that really matter and determine really how good we're going to be. Now, one of the reasons you're here as well is because of the great support from the NSCAA. Talk about what that organization has meant to you as a coach. Uh, it's a tremendous organization. First of all, it, it celebrates uh, the, the youth players and uh, does a tremendous job in recognizing their achievements and their development. But more importantly, it also helps uh, the coaches in their development so they can have an impact on youth players. And for me, uh, it, it's been a tr tremendous benefit to be associated with the NSCAA. And, um, you know, I look forward to the future because they continue to grow and, and make huge steps and strides in helping the game grow. And Ken Lola helping the University of Louisville soccer team. This is the Mondo Coaches Interview. The coaches' interviews are brought to you by Mondo. Mondo, manufacturer of the Mondo Turf artificial turf system and the patented Echo Fill Star Info, is now the official turf company of the NSCAA. The Mondo Turf system features Mondo's newest generation of polyethylene fibers, which look and feel like natural grass and use color pigments that are free of toxins and heavy metals. Echo Fill, the company's environmentally friendly infill, is made from a synthetic material and not reground tire pellets. For more information about Mondo, visit MondoUSA.com.